We got information coming to us. I want to thank Sheila of Alabama for this report. But the Syrian capital of Damascus has been hit. I repeat, the Syrian capital of Damascus has been hit, has been attacked, and the pipelines that lead to the city has been exploded, severed, what have you, but has put the entire city of Damascus in the dark. What? Are you serious? Yes. The Syrian capital, Damascus, was hit by a power cut late uh, last night, October 23rd, 2013, shortly after an explosion near the international airport. The whole city just went dark. I'm talking the whole city, said a resident who lives in the center of the city of Damascus and asked to remain anonymous, of course, due to the murder and the mayhem and the massacring that's going on there. Well, uh, uh, Damascus, it's being reported that uh, you could see from a distance a huge fire blazing near the Damascus International Airport, which is located near the affected power station. A Damascus resident told Al Jazeera television on Thursday morning that power had been restored in most of the capital, but it was a very long night. State news agency SANA has quoted the electricity minister Ahmad Kaimis as saying the electricity in all providences have been cut off due to the terrorist attack on the gas pipeline feeding the electricity generating stations in the southern region of the, of the uh, nation. A terrorist attack on a gas pipeline that feeds a power station in the south has led to the power outages there in Damascus. So, uh, there is some biblical prophecy. We know what it says in Isaiah chapter 17, verse 1. The burden of Damascus. Behold, Damascus is no longer a city, but has become a ruinous heap. But did you know that Jeremiah also prophesied of the apocalyptic events that would come upon the ancient city of Damascus. And here's what it says in Jeremiah chapter 49, verse 23 through 27. Concerning Damascus, Hamath is confounded and Arpad, for they have heard evil tidings. They are faint-hearted. There is sorrow on the sea. It cannot be quiet. Damascus is waxed feeble. It turneth herself to flee, and fear has seized on her. Anguish and sorrows have taken her as a woman in travail. How is the city of praise not left, the city of my joy? Therefore her young men shall fall in her streets, and all the men of war shall be cut off. In that day, saith the Lord of hosts, and I will kindle a fire in the wall of Damascus, and it shall consume the palaces of Ben-Hadad. Bible prophecy fulfilling itself in the war-torn nation of Syria and in the ancient capital of Damascus. Pray for the people there. Many of the Christians are being slaughtered as the fighting continues between President Bashar Assad and his forces, backed by the Soviet Union or the Russians, and the radical Islamic Muslim Brotherhood, and their freedom fighters, backed by the Obama administration of America. Pray for peace.